so many people watch porn. That's it's like the biggest demand. Like mm-hmm. of, I remember seeing this thing of like how long it took all these different sites to get like 500 million views or something. And it was like YouTube and Pornhub and Pornhub would like took so quick to get all those views. You yeah. know, everyone watches porn, most people, but everyone wants to talk shit about porn stars. Mm-hmm. The people that they're jacking off to every mm-hmm. single day, mm-hmm. but they want to talk down to us when they're the one watching us. Yeah. So it's so frustrating and they just see us as like this this fantasy on a computer and that we don't have another life. And that's like, I'm like already itching to write another book. Mm -hmm. And I kind of want to like in some way get across the point of that porn stars are people Mm -hmm. and maybe like dig into like how, like the double life that I have to live and Mm -hmm. like the stigma that, you know, it's so hard as like a performer when someone like you're getting your nails done. Oh, what do you do for work? Like, it's just cause you know, people are going to look down upon it. So it's frustrating when even though I'm not ashamed of what I do, it's hard to tell people what I do because I know they're going to judge me. Well, the thing is, I think that a lot of people who look down on porn stars and who have that idea about the porn industry are people who generally have hangups about their own sexuality and are ashamed of masturbation, are ashamed of um, sex. Right. And so they project that feeling onto you. You know, like so many people have an unhealthy relationship with sex because – I mean, so many reasons, lack of sexual education yeah. and just the way that society in general is so fearful of sexuality, especially female sexuality. Because right. yeah. you never really see people go, you know, like after, you know, saving male porn stars, right? Totally it's true. It's always about women. And like this, I bet the same guys who are like looking down on these girls and saying that are like loving the wishing they were these male porn stars. You know, yeah. it's. It's always it's, like that. It's like cool. And it just goes back to like the old sexist, like double standard. You know, if you're a guy, if you fuck a bunch of broads, like you're a stud. Mm-hmm. If you're a girl and you fuck a bunch of guys, you're a slut. Yeah. You know, like it's just like it, and it's just per, it's projected in the way that people see porn and see sex. But, you know, I mean, I think people like you writing these kinds of books and you know, showing who you are and, and hopefully things like this podcast and stuff. I mean, we're here to change people's mind yeah. about how they see porn and about how they see sex. And I feel like I see changes. It's going to take a while. We may have to, you know, a couple generations kind of like, breed the stigma out of yeah. people, you know? Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, make sure that you subscribe so you don't miss a single episode and go check out all the other videos. I film every single one of my podcasts. And if you want to listen to the audio version, I'm on iTunes and all the other podcast platforms. Visit hollyrandallunfiltered.com to find out more.